Space, the final frontier. These are the voyages of Chuck. His mission to become the richest man in the galaxy. Hello, hello, hello. That looks like a very nice planet. There must be something or someone that'll be able to help me get to my goal. Let's take a look. Could have had me one more shot. Oh no. Another ship. What are they gonna do? Finish me off? Where are they all coming from? This is the captain of the starship in front of you. Do you require assistance? Assistance? Somebody shooting at me for no reason trying to kill me. They're Klingons. They don't need a reason. Would you decross into their neutral zone? I don't know anything about that. But I'm venting Triox profusely. My oxygen and power will be gone very soon. Come round the back of the starship to the hangar bay. Don't come in too hot. You'll be instructed where to land. Aye aye, Captain. Security to the hangar bay. Security to the hangar bay. And stop dancing. Captain? So who are you and what are you doing in the neutral zone? My name would be way too long for you to pronounce. But you can call me Chuck. And my business? Supply and demand. You need something? I can get it for you. Price negotiable. You're a scapo. No, 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 Captain. I'm not a scavenger. I run a high-class reputable enterprise. That's a play on words. Yeah, you are a scapo. I've got a deal for you, Captain. Considering the date of this ship, I'm sure you're in need of the lithium crystals. And I have some. I'm afraid, though, the price is going to be very, very high. Here's the deal. We'll fix your old ship, or make it better than it was. We won't install an ID chip, and we won't tell the Federation of your violation of the neutral zone. And for that, we will take the dilithium crystals off your hands. That's a terrible deal, Captain. I'm afraid I must refuse. Well, we could always put you in the brig. Well, looks like I've come forced to accept this awful deal. For the moment, I'd like to say it was nice doing business with you, Captain, but it hasn't. I have a funny feeling we haven't seen the last of him. I too have a feeling that our paths will cross again, Captain. You? A feeling, Spark? They sometimes come to the surface if I'm not careful, Captain. Really? Very illogical. <laughs>
Captain, somebody started a chuck ship up and was preparing to take off. Close the hangar bay doors, Mr. Godfrey. Aye, aye, Captain. An operator, it says you don't have the correct permissions to perform this action, Captain. It's good, this is the captain. Stop chuck ship from leaving the hangar bay. Better than that, guys. <laughs> the ship has left the hangar bay with minimal damage, Captain. Go ahead, Captain. Do your thing. I know you wanna. Activate the tractor beam, Mr. Helmsman. Bring that ship back. Captain? It says this action can't be performed because it's open to being used by another system. Arm phasers. A direct hit would implode that size of target, Captain. Noted, Spock. Arm phasers. Shoot across his bow, but make it very close, Mr. Godfrey. Absolutely, Captain. Says you performed an unauthorized action. The system will now shut down. Captain. Your ship's primary functions have been disabled by me. They will come back online shortly. Your biggest mistake was you underestimated me, Captain. I'm quite resourceful. I've decided not to enjoy your hospitality at this time. I've taken my dilithium crystals with me, as it appeared you didn't really want them. Oh, and I found some cold bite in the storage area. I thought that might come in handy. So you see, it has been nice doing business with you, after all. This ship may not look very much, but it has many modifications, and one of them is light speed. So, bon voyage, Captain, and never the twain shall meet. <laughs> <laughs>